All right, hello and welcome back. I'm Sean T.D. Stewart, the home gamer. I'm here again playing Final Fantasy XIV. Uh, we're actually jumping into the... Uh, um, jumping into a duty right now. Let's do what it is. Waiting. Waiting for it to load.
Alrighty then everybody, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. That was me. Uh, whoops, I just jumped off a cliff. <laughs> there we go, that was fly. Um, <laughs> that was me, I uh, did a duty finder, uh, duty roulette for level 50, 60 dungeons. Uh, that was, I can't remember which one that one was. It was Midsgard or or House of Rider dungeon. That one's a lot of fun. Uh, but did that. Let's go ahead and collect our materia prize on this one. And that's actually that actually clears this section of the side quest, except for the picture quest. Uh, and there's well, actually one more down here also uh, that I gotta pick up. But uh, let me think. Actually, let's do that real quick so that way we can start with a new set of quests. Uh, the picture one is, that's just going to have to wait. We'll have to save that for the very end. Because that one is insanity. I haven't, well, not insanity. I just, I've, I remember running around previously trying to find the uh, location in the picture. And I couldn't find it for the life of me. So hopefully, uh, after I cleared these side quests, the rest of the side quests in this section, which is uh, in Othar and Zancia, I can find that picture location. Because I was able to find the ones in Kugane, but those ones were actually relatively easy. There were more reference points that were more distinct. The reference points in this map are not very distinct, so it's harder to find the location. And there are probably, there's probably some clues. And I saw there's like one or two features that I can try to match against. 
but unfortunately, like I said, they're not extremely distinct. I saw several examples of those features throughout this map. Let's go ahead and drop off these items, <clears throat> collect our bounty, our prize, our reward for this quest. There we go. Bada bing, bada boom, and there's some quests in this area now that just appear. So this is perfect. So when we come back in the next episode, we'll do Duty Finder again. So we get some Tone Stones of Verity, and we'll do the quests that are now available in this section of the map. Uh, let's, oh, we're checking our currency. So I'm going to check the currency. We got 335. I think that's enough for maybe an accessory. And what gear do we still need? We still need a weapon, which costs 500. This is expensive. Those are good. We need a sh arm guards, uh, brace, and shoes, and another ring that are uh, 300 level 300 or above and our average level item is up to 296 so we're close we're definitely getting close uh, we're also going to need a mender actually here's a mender right now so we'll mend our gear with this guy repair our gear repair all Woo, 3200 some uh it's been a while since i repaired my gear my gear normally doesn't get that low um all right cool so we did that. Let's see what one of those guys selling real quick. Now that I'm, since I'm here. Uh, oh, he's selling like uh, level 273 gear. Some cool, some cool garments, you know. Some headgear that's interesting. Uh, but yeah, this stuff is still low level. Way too low level. All right, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, please tune in next time to watch me play more Final Fantasy XIV. It'll be the same thing again. It'll be me doing side quests. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Looks like side, seven side quests just in this uh, Zuka Manor. Z Yazuka Manor. It's hard to see the name. The name is uh, blocked. So there's seven side quests here. So we'll go ahead and do a duty finder. We'll probably be able to knock out those seven side quests uh, while we're waiting for the duty finder to match us with the party. So that's that's what the near future is going to look like until we get all of our uh, above level 300 gear and we're able to continue with the, the dungeons at the uh, level 300 gear and above level. So again, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. Please join again next time. I'm Sean T.D. Stewart, the home gamer, and have a great day.